What's going on, guys? I'm the Inhumans not quite awake enough down. That's a phrase. You know, going. I'm tired. But I don't want to go to sleep because it's like 10 o'clock in the morning and I got work after this. So sadly, sleeping's not an option. <sighs> it's a big friend for a bunch of that. Anyways, the last time we encountered Dr. Doom, who was trying to remake the Empire State whatever, and we used Mr. Fantastic and fought him, and it's all like, No, I can't do what I want! Now we're off to the premium mission, Tooth and Claw! Which is gonna involve Wolverine! Yes, Wolverine. <sighs> we're looking at intensive mutant activity in and around the Museum of Natural History. And by intensive, I mean that someone mutated a bunch of the patrons, forcibly, with ISO-8. Of course, forcibly, why not? Magneto, wonder if this is part of an operation with Doom, or is he looking for ISO-8 and new mutants on his own? Getting intel scan results, I'm seeing both ISO-8 and MGH. I think that stands for Mutant Growth Hormone. Tony, I need you to keep... I need to keep you chained up in the lab while Intel reports are being analyzed. Agent, find out if Doom's around and what he and Magneto are doing together. Tic tac toe. Patty cake. I don't fucking know. Fucking. I know if I know shit, man. Anyways, I'm gonna be taking. Uh, I can't words. Oh, I'm so tired. I can't brain. <laughs> I can't. I just can't anymore. Uh. I'm not waking up for this shit. Anyways, I'm gonna be taking several of your uh your ideas for uh what you guys want me to do. Um, what what is that? I promise sentences are not as broken as this. Just not awake. I'm literally surviving off a half cup of monster I got poured into a cup with uh, some Dr. Pepper. Mmm, the taste of caffeine. Anyways, I'm going to be taking your suggestions for a couple team ups you guys wanted me to do. I won't be doing them in the necessary team up order that you guys have suggested, but I will be combining several people together, such as I believe one person wanted me to use Blade. Which is good. We haven't seen our. Our uh, vampire hunting friend in quite some time, and uh, I would be using his partner in crime, Morbius, but unfortunately, those scrappers would make short work of him, so we'll be using Thane instead. Also, later, we have a friend who wants to say hello from the future! <laughs> but more on that later, so for now, let's, uh, let's kick some. Uh, I forgot what the hell these things are called. Test subjects. That's it. Test subjects ass. That is what I wanted to call them. Alright, first things first. Ceiling touch. Cool. I fucked it up already. Don't worry, Blade. I'll let you have your fun. You can kill that one. Is he bleeding? No, of course he's not. <laughs> Why would he be bleeding? Now he's definitely bleeding. Okay. Alright. I don't know what just happened, but you're dead now. Ah! And if you're not dead, you are now. Alright, you guys. The red underwear. We match! Probably more than anyone wanted to know about me right now. Uh, exploit stunned, huh? Alright. Try to use the ceiling touch on this guy. <clears throat> I'll suit up with a psychic amp. Actually, I've got a better idea. Uh, I know I got one around here. Um, 
Is this it? Yep, bingo! Now I can strike this guy down. And also murder him. But that's just the bonus part of attacking him, but... Eh, details. You know what, Blade? Go ahead and finish him. Bloodlust. Thank you, Blade. Let's see, cross those two off my list. Not really, you're just gonna give me these. Come on, these are pathetic. Oh well, someone wanted to see hybrid, so hybrid he shall become. I suppose now is a good chance to also showcase the uh, new and improved Spider Gwen, and by new and improved, I mean she's almost level 9. I'll almost have her being good. Almost. So close. Yet so far away. What the shock? Jehovah's Witnesses? I'm not making this shit up either! <laughs> Ignore the ringing doorbells. I am not home. <laughs> so if you hear ringing doorbells in the background, or fucking uh, other things, you'll know why. Or puppies. The puppies are very up in arms about it. It's like, oh, here's something! Don't trust their sweet words, puppies. They only want to steal your soul. Wonder if they've left yet. I don't really want to get up and check. Go Spider Gwen. Wonder how much more powerful you'll be once I get you to level 9. I guess we'll find out then. Alright, hybrid, take him out. I love you so much. You are like one of my favorite lockbox heroes. There's Toad, just like last time. I'll bet he's running the lab where these mutants are created. Last time Sabretooth was his overseer. Think that'll be the same too? I wouldn't be surprised. Magneto has his favorites. This is very true. Let's go greet the Toad, shall we? Hell, it's tough time Logan. Something happened to you. You don't stink as bad as you did last time. That's Magneto. He made that happen. He can do anything. Persuasive. You should see what Magneto's doing with ISO 8. I will, as soon as I root him out of whatever hole he's hide he's in. Oh, he won't, because I'm going to put you in a hole. Toad started off sounding like Gollum. Alright, uh, I'd love to use Saber or Wolverine here. We'll save him for the Encore. Instead... This looks like a job for Superman. Or another equal opportunist. Uh, where the hell is he? Star-Lord. And let's see. Uh, I don't really feel like using 2099 yet. Save him for the final act. Instead. Ah, there's a thought. Actually, you know what? I'll save them for next time. Uh, magic. 
Except magic, I wish you'd change because you're not in your new mutants out. All out. I don't know. I have words. <laughs> I can words real well, I promise. There we go. Cool metal arm and shiny glowy sword. Or at least better glowy sword, I suppose. Let's do this. Let's rumble. Charged fists. Oh no, whatever will I do? I stun her? No, it didn't. Cool. Alright. First of all, stepping disc. Next thing. Quantum jump. 12% of a plan. Way to go. We then apply another quantum jump to the sky. Which, apply fumbling. <laughs> Cute. Next. Oh, you're kidding me. I'd rather kill one of you with that. I choose not to, though. So instead, unleash hell! One enemy. Here we go. All enemies. <laughs> Damn, I was actually hoping to kill all of them with that. I'm pretty dramatic. But I'll suppo I suppose I'll have to take what I can get. Alright, Toad. Come on and play. Do I have full charge? No, I don't. But I have potential unleashed, but that's not going to be enough. There we go. Soul Sword. Holy shit, maybe I should have gone for the attack. Goodbye. <laughs> you know what happens to a toe that's struck by lightning? He dies. I already made that joke. <laughs> Would you expect me to make it again? Albeit not planned, but still. We got him. If you don't touch him or let him spit or kick or get his tongue around your neck, he's a piece of cake. Where you see the toad, the blob's usually not far away. Let's go get him. Alright. I'll take your word that he's around here. Some of the test subjects are hauled up deep in the bowels of the museum, searching for an obscure item in its collection. We're getting ridiculous ISO 8 readings from in there. Send Phoenix to terminate that mission per prematurely, I think. Whatever. Alright, here's a good chance to show showcase their power. Uh, someone wanted me to use the twins, so I might as well. Um, where the hell are they? There's one. Here's the second. There he is. Both donning their Age of Ultron outfits. Because... Can. I guess. Maybe. Can I, though? Can I really? The answer is yes. Yes, I can. Alright, first things first. Blinding punches. And more blinding punches. And these guys are infiltrators, so I can't really make benefit of them. And tag team. Next on the list, Hex Spheres. Alright, time to build up more blinding punches. Don't want to attack that guy, honestly. I don't want him to get too powerful. Why did I get three turns? Attacks, because present. 
No, seriously, why did I get three turns? Well, my attacks become a quick action? I don't really know. What the hell happened? Alright, wh whatever. I'm honestly not going to argue anymore. Or maybe I'm just losing my mind and have no idea what's going on. <laughs> maybe I've finally gone crazy. Though, some could argue I've been crazy for quite some time, but that's neither here nor there. I'm about to rock you. Like a hurricane. That's me done, you comrade. All right, what's next? Uh, maybe Blob now? There's the Blob! Surve <clears throat> Surveillance found him through a careful look, uh, through a careful look at the area's gravitational field. He deforms it enough to detect. Wolverine, you ready? To take some pieces out of the blob? Can't wait. Good to know. Uh, Professor Xavier is requesting a face-to-face -face meeting with S.H.I.E.L.D. to clarify our intentions with respect to mutants and ISO-8 and Hero to get everyone on the same page moving forward. Um, actually, you know what, um, Bishop, I don't have to tell you that we need to keep Xavier on our side, but we need to keep Xavier on our side. Thank you. Redundant, much redundant. He's going to be a critical counterbalance to the Brotherhood's activities. All right. What's next? Oh, I got a good team for this one. You keep doing this, Blob. Any mutiny needs big dumb muscle. You're there. Why? Maybe I ain't as dumb as you think. I get to do what I like, and I get paid for it. Xavier gave you a chance. You turned it down. I think that makes you pretty dumb. I think calling me dumb makes you pretty dead. Nobody stops a blob. Except for X-Force. And with that, of course, being Phantom X. And where is the other combatant? Spiral. Let's dance. And both of mine know how to dance pretty well. You can dance if you want to. You can leave your friends behind, cause if your friends don't dance, and if they don't dance well, I'm gonna shoot you in the kneecaps. Alright, let's see. Anything really I uh, get from so- I don't see! No, oh, you should be depowered. How the hell did you do that? Oh. Offensive action. Clever girl. <laughs> Clever girl. Movable object. Double punch. Eh. <laughs> Alright. Movable object. Protecting eyes from attacks. Ignores energy from non energy type attacks. Well, non-energy, you say. I wonder if that counts magic as well. Frutte in tornate. <laughs> All right, he's protecting shit. And that didn't do a damn thing. Right. Second plan of action. Psychic poking stick. Oh, 
Well, thank you for taking out your own guy. You missed, by the way. Alright, let's see. Cabri Fandango. What does this one do? Let's do this one. Dance, magic, dance. I guess I could have used that one to kill him, but, eh, irrelevant. That didn't do nearly as much damage as I was hoping it would. Well, as long as he doesn't use a movable object anytime soon, this battle is still mine. No other choice, just gotta shoot him. And I'll form the blade. Alright, problem solved. Well, at least that problem, anyways. Take care of Blob. Man, he can take a lot of punishment. Luckily, I can give a lot, too. Good teamwork, Bub. The Blob has left a lot of flattened shield rookies in his trail. Nick, come on in and pick him up. Agent, we've got the big man to find, and I think I know who it is. Is it the fact you can smell him? Oh, God. I was gonna say, that's me, I'm gonna have to do three more fights. I don't wanna do three more fights. So let's pick up these guys. That'll spawn Sabretooth. Oh, come on, really? Sounds like that one will. Xavier is issuing a public statement that he trusts S.H.I.E.L.D. to handle the demonstrations fairly. That's going to defang some of the Brotherhood's, uh, Gravances? Gravances? Maybe it'll even keep the peace. Doubtful. This doesn't start any dialogue, I'm gonna pull the hero. While we're chasing test subjects in the Brotherhood, monitors across from museums have picked up possible Jotun activity. Send the hero out for visual confrontation. I right, nothing, I'm pulling him out. Well, put this one out. The museum complex is a maze. We need someone with tactical skills to do initial recon and come up with the most effective way to get at the Brotherhood forces inside. Uh. Hawkeye. Okay. I'm actually surprised that didn't actually, uh, cause, uh, Sabretooth to come out of hiding, so we'll just go fight this easy mission. This mission's taking a lot longer than I thought. Then again, I'm not using, like, my full A-team. Pim. Good sir, Ant-Man. <laughs> Let's take him on, shall we? Shouldn't be too much we can't handle. Very good, and we went first. Greatest allies! Army of Ants! Interrupting Brawl. I will stop you dead in your tracks. Emphasis on the term, dead. Told you so. Thank you for that. And I've got this one. No problem for the Ant-Men. 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 Uh, sounds weird. Alright, that ought to trigger him. Sabretooth, that's who was running this show, just like back in Times Square. Logan, you sure we shouldn't send someone else on this detail? Nick, when did I ever turn down a job? We did. When did you ever have to treat me like a baby? Lock down his location and stay the hell out of my way. Comforting. 
All right, let's pick up Hawkeye. It's time for a showdown. I need energy. There we go. All right, let's do this. I'm not dignifying that with a response. They're not brothers. <laughs> Nothing else to say. Nope. Let's get this reunion started. Canadian style. All right. Need a little help from the future. Whoop. 299 here to help. I stand by my decision that he's the second best spider so far. Silk could prove to be interesting as well. But I'll have to see her when we get her. <laughs> Son of a glitch? Which, for those who don't know, Son of a Glitch applies weak point to enemies, and we all get mirror images. And I actually expect them to lower his proc rate for that, because it's fucking ridiculous, his proc rate for a Son of a Glitch. See? The sad part is it doesn't even stack or anything. So, I don't know. They might lower it. They might not. It just all depends. I don't really think it's that big of an issue because it doesn't honestly help that much. It's only a 70% chance that they'll dodge. And it's only a, a single target attack. So, theoretically, that means that it's still ways to get around it. Especially if you've got something that has True Strike or something like that. Well, I'm actually disappointed that uh, 299 isn't getting a chance to show his uh, power. So, let's solve that, shall we? Oh, I know, it's still back. Alright. Uh, Chrono Accelerator. Son of a glitch. Jam it. And what the shock? Which didn't know Spider Man bit people. That's definitely interesting. Then again, I've never really read the 2099 comic books. Despite being a fan of 2099, all my knowledge really comes from uh, Shattered Dimensions. Let's say, good god, you done attacking yet? Alright, let's take care of uh, Sabretooth. And what was the two weapons we can get from this? Uh, the Snicked, which is actually, uh... Used to be one of the sound effects used for uh, Wolverine's claws. Follow up, bleeding times two. And the Sabretooth Claw. Sabretooth's Claw counterattack. And a single target attack has a chance to perform a counterattack when attacked. Uh, Ravage Bleeding. Eh. Thank you. He's on the move, Nick. I'm going after him. Negative. Repeat. It's his family. You don't tell me what to do. He's not technically your family. Just saying the movie made up that part. Ooh, shiny gold bar. Return test subjects. Ugh. Return test subjects to the helicarrier to see if they can be Tony. Think you can help? I'll do what I can. Xavier said he'll send some help, uh, some people to too. These test subjects are a mess. They can't think. Their mutations are unstable. I'd say Magneto's ISO-8 experiments aren't going well. I bet that's fine with him. He's got an unlimited supply of disposable goons to throw at us while he pursues his real agenda. 
The Brotherhood of Mutants is on the move, and they're targeting New York. So far, ISO-8 is bringing out the worst in the worst. Let's make sure it brings out the best in us. Alright. And with that done, next time we'll be taking a look at Chapter 5. So until then, I'll catch you all later. Asta.